Okay, I think that I got all the kinks worked out of the fuel delivery system. I bought a new fuel pump. I still couldn't get it to work, so I went ahead and rewired it. And it turned out that the problem in it ended up being a um, electrical problem that I never actually like located what the problem was. I just rewired it and suddenly it worked, so it had to have been an electronic problem. But anyways, so the original um, fuel setup had two fuel pumps, one in the tank to the right and then one outside the tank to the left. And um, the Megasquirt EFI only needs um, one fuel pump. Because the reason why it had two fuel pumps to begin with was to boost up the pressure for the CIS uh, fuel system. So the um, fuel pump on the right is effectively a spout. That then uh, the fuel flows out of the tank into the fuel pump to the left and uh, up into the engine. So the red wire is my new wiring job, which is kind of janky looking, but it works. I'll show you what's doing here. We have an uh, empty water jug where the fuel is going to flow into. And it may seem pretty simple, but I've been working on this for two, like two weeks and I could not get it to work. So the fact that I can get fuel from the pump into this water jug is a pretty big deal. Um, so the way I have it is I took the fuel pump relay out and I'm basically just jumping it. So the red wire that was connected to the fuel pump, here it is. And um, it's a lot longer than it needs to because I haven't um, put the wire underneath the carpet or anything. It's just hanging out. So. Here is the spade connector that I'm going to use to jump the relay. And let's see if I can do I don't think I've done this with the camera going. This is kind of difficult to do to begin with. So um, the lighting's really bad, but I need to connect it to terminal 30 or 87. And oh, it's not easy to get in there. There we go. Now let's go back to the fuel pump. Here's the wiring diagrams I've been working with. There's our fuel. It's a pretty good amount of fuel. And then you can hear the fuel pump. It's buzzing away. No fuel leaks or anything. So I put two gallons of fuel in there. And let me show you. It's not really doing anything. Um, it just kind of sits there and pumps fuel, makes a lot of noise. So, there you go.